Hey guys, welcome back to another brand new Hoplite video. Now, I have played a bunch of games today and also yesterday and they haven't gone too well. Like, I've been getting like, say, five kills and then I've just been dying because other people just have better stuff than me. And I've been thinking, why is that? And most of it is because I'm getting a little bit unlucky. Like, I'm killing a lot of people, but I'm not really gaining anything from it. And then other people are just coming up with like speed and strength potions. And obviously that's like impossible to fight. So, um, in this game, I actually have no different plans except for just to <laughs> go down straight away and get as many diamonds as possible. Let's help this guy out a little bit. Got to be nice to the new players. And yeah, looking at this lobby, I don't really see anyone that is like standing out that is insanely good. I can recognize like 1.8 players and stuff and know if they're good or not. I don't know if they're going to be very good at like 1.20. Um, but yeah, like I've gone up to people thinking they're not going to be good at the game and then they just turn out to be like some very good 1.9 plus PvP -er, and they just absolutely destroy me. As well, something I want to talk about is do you guys think there should be any nerfs or buffs in Harplight right now? Because I've been thinking and I think gaps definitely need to heal uh, a lot quicker than 15 or 20 seconds or whatever it is. I think it should be 10. Um, I don't know. I feel like you just heal way too slow with gaps. I'm not too sure. And yeah, the game is fun and everything and it's pretty fine just how they are. But I feel like it could be better if they just reduce the time it takes to regen. And I just got an extra diamond from that present, which is pretty insane. So now we can have a diamond sword and also... An enchantment table if we want to. There is diamonds right there. I need blocks. Is it one diamonds? Oh, he's giving me diamonds. No, you take those. Those are yours. And more diamonds over there. No way. As well, I've been uploading Hoplite videos for about two months now, which is pretty insane. Um, it's just awesome to see how much support I got over the last two months. And um, yeah, I just want to thank everyone for that. And yeah, just expect me to keep uploading Hoplite videos. There's no reason for me to do anything different. So... I'm just going to continue to do it. But yeah, as well as the gaps being changed, I think it would be a good idea for them to uh, add more crafts that require heads. Like, even simple ones that aren't legendaries. Like, I think there needs to be more. Because other than... Like, let's say I make 2G heads, right? And I don't have much healing. I don't really want to gamble making Ares Blessing because I could get something really bad, you know? So, like, I should be able to make something... I don't know. I mean, not even just, like, healing stuff. Just anything to do with heads. Okay, this cave seems to be dying a bit. So, okay, never mind. Oh, what? I need to get that before it despawns. Quick. Nice, that's a head. They had no diamonds. And there's a locked out player. What? That's so random. Nice. Now, another thing is a gap is literally better than a regular head. And speed one isn't actually, like, very good. So, it's like, there's no point having heads unless the G heads, really, in my opinion. Okay, I don't even have enough sugar cane for a decent amount of books. Let's do this. Okay, is it worth just making two diamond swords? Hmm. I think it might be, I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> like, I could have got more books, but... Yeah, we're just saving time doing this. And yeah, we could have had diamond boots, but... I are just gonna make people not want to fight us we want to fight as many people as possible and if i have a better sword it's kind of good okay one area's blessing and one g heads we're gonna avoid using the g heads at all costs but if i really need to i'll do it two cry nobby that's actually really good that's huge okay feather falling no thank you i'm breaking it's fine i don't mind that Okay, so we got a sharp two diamond, power two bow, four gaps, a G head, two diamonds, two cryonobby. And yeah, I feel like this is pretty good loot, to be honest. Very happy with it. And there's a guy there that we can fight when PvP enables. He's got a short sword. And if he just continues to look in the same direction, we can basically kill him for free. Don't gap, please. He's bowing. <laughs> this is so awkward. Nice, let's go. Took a lot of damage that we didn't need to, but there's what it is. And two puffer fish. If we get TNT, we can make a puffer fish cannon, which I don't even think is worth making, in my opinion. 
Can we get a sharpness book? Yes, we can. Huge. Can we get another sharpness book? Yes, we can. We just need a little bit of XP. And there's a guy here. That's fine. Let's shoot him once. Shoot him twice. Or not. Let's go. Okay, we're definitely going to get clean, so I have to kill this guy quickly. Nice. And we got a bunch of XP from him. And, okay, four diamonds. No ammo fish shards on him, unfortunately. Diamond boots is not a bad idea. Let's make it Ares Blessing as well. I really think it's not good to just keep regular heads on you. You have to make a G head or just Ares Blessing with them straight away. Like, I really just don't think it's worth having a regular head. Need to do something with it. See, 32 golds, that's huge. I knew I should have got more apples. And yeah, something I want them to add is the option to turn on lightning sounds, because there's 30 people left in the game right now, and I, I, there could have been like, I don't know, 60 a minute ago, and I'd have no idea. Like, you can kind of, when you're listening to lightning, you can kind of tell how many people are dying, and it's a nice feeling. And these two have been to the nether, so they're not going to have like any healing, so it's a very easy clean. And one of them's about to die, he's on 13. That guy has an ender bow, but we don't care. You're on full HP. Damn. What is this? He's on 5 HP. And this guy's Midas, of course. Okay, we need to kill this guy. So this guy got Midas and a flame bow. I can't get hit. I'm screwed. Please keep chasing me. Because I would love to kill you. It seems like a Timbo as well, because it does a lot of damage. It's annoying I didn't kill the other guy, and he isn't even cleaning. Like, he was losing the bow fight, so wanting to continue to bow is a little crazy. And there's people over there. I need to fight this guy. Quick. Let's make some boots. He hasn't healed. He's got nothing. I think we regen slow enough for that not to be a waste. He's on 17. Maybe he has, like, 1G heads. That guy's on 44, so hopefully he stays over there. Okay, so only sharp one Midas. He had a punch a protection book. Flame one, power one. Not great. And he had a regen two pot for 22 seconds. I really need to get protection on these boots. Nice. Uh, that's prot two. Okay, so I'm going to make a sharp three diamonds. And I'm going to use the Midas, but only when I get kills. I'm not going to use it right now. And then once we get it to a sharp four, I'll switch. Because if I'm running around with a Midas sword, people are going to see it and not want to fight me. So it's not good in that sense, but also the fact that I have to get multiple kills to upgrade it. But yeah, if you guys are wondering why I don't use my offhand, I just think it's really off-putting and just overcomplicates stuff. Um, yeah, I just don't like it. I think the only thing I'll use in my offhand is a magma sword. Okay, so hopefully you guys have been enjoying this video so far. If you have, make sure to like and subscribe. And um, yeah, let's see if we can get more kills. There should be like one or two people fighting somewhere near us. I'd guess over that way on the other side is 0 0 probably. And as well, I do want to keep this regen 2 pot for deathmatch. Like, when the border closes in, it's kind of hard to heal from gaps. And if you don't have any G heads, well, I've obviously only got one G head, it's going to be pretty difficult. So the pot is perfect. Especially when it's regen 2. Oh, this guy's a fan. Let's see what the other person's at, if I can hit him. What is he at? I think we just go for him. This guy's on 12 HP. Yeah, G heads. See a regular gap. I need to try kill him with the Midas to get. Oh. Okay. You're on 40. <laughs> you drank an Insta 4, I think. Is that. Oh, there's two people over there.
We should be going for this. This guy, man. So much more to gain around you. But you continue to go for me. I'm not going to use this G-head this early. I need to save it for deathmatch. Oh, and he has a fire sword. GG. Where's he at? 12? Alright, he left the clean to go for me. That guy's on 9 HP with the boots. I really shouldn't play Nicked, because... Like, I definitely would have got out of that situation, I think. <laughs> That's so unfortunate. Like, the guy with the boots just threw his own game to kill me. And he didn't even do that. Don't know how I survived, to be honest. He should have no idea that I'm here. If he turns around, that's so unfortunate. And there's another guy behind me. Ace Drag. That's definitely not the full iron. Yeah, you're not cleaning me. I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> jeez. Got destroyed. I need water. Quick. That guy's definitely coming back for me. Okay, so there's no point me using the Midas now. Because I didn't kill either of those people with it. And it's only sharp this one. And I feel like it would make me more of a target. So I'm not going to bother doing that. 12 levels. It's probably better just for me to get power 3 flame. See, the other guy had a fire sword and full diamonds. I can't really compete with that, to be honest. And we got 3 minutes till deathmatch. So, yeah, I don't really know what to do. Like, we can make a sharp... Four, but I think it might be a better idea for me to make a power three flame. And there is a power book in here. So let's do that instead. We haven't really gained from me getting crit out because I lost G heads and stuff. All right, there's another full diamond, which is nice. As this shouldn't be too expensive. 13 levels. How much is it the other way? 17? 13. That's disgusting. What? I'm getting scammed. Power two flame will do. I'll save up for sharp four. Should make both of these, I think. Need to get something. Alright, if we don't get anything good from this, kind of screwed. Knockback fish, that's actually good. Too bad it's only knockback three. When the border closes in, I can literally just push someone out of the border infinitely, pretty much. Okay, this is going to be a very difficult deathmatch to win because we have to fight two full diamonds and I've only got five gaps on one head. So if we win this, then... I'm pretty insane. CCL is on 4 HP. If he doesn't die before deathmatch, we can kill him and take the stuff. Uh, Tamakles was the other full diamond. So we need to kill CCL pretty much. We want gaps and diamonds from middle. This guy ender build. Are you serious? I need to get this one. Too late. Yeah, he literally got everything. That's unfortunate. Um, What do we do? This guy, we kill him. I've got like 4 pairs of diamond boots. Okay. Okay, let's just relax for a bit. Never mind. <laughs> Don't think we're going to be able to relax. And I got eight diamonds for a chest plate. Go away. I think he just wants me to fight him because he has, like, nothing left. And that was his last hope. I mean, he literally went down to 4 HP, so... It was pretty guaranteed for him to not have anything there. I need his diamond armor, quickly. That's another sharp on Midas. Fire prot 3. Is that a prot 3 chest plate? Prot 2? Not bad. Okay, so we got... Eight levels of XP, not great. Okay, five heads, but I can't craft anything with them. Any protection books? Huge, actually. That's insane. That's actually really good. I thought you would just let me do that, to be honest. Like, he's got chased by the other guy for ages. I literally can't do anything else. I've made all my XP bottles, made all my Aries Blessings. We just have to stick with this loot. See, I don't have any G heads, so this actually could be very hard to win. I think I just need to start using these heads because obviously I'm not going to be able to eat them all at the end. I 
and to build away. Oh, he has a knockback fish as well. Okay, we need to kill this guy. Like, I'll probably die to the last guy because he has a fire sword and G heads, maybe. But I don't want to be the one who's just not fighting. Like, this deathmatch is going to take forever. And I don't want to win in a boring way. Heads. See what I mean? Like, it's just so dumb for me to be fighting. Alright, let's spawn in the dogs. Because now we're in a position where they're not really going to be bowing. I wish there was a different way I could play this, but I don't have G-heads, so I literally, like, can't compete with them at the end of the game. Even though I've got full pro 2. Because one of them has to have a G-head. This guy's potting up. Oh, he's fighting. Nice. Perfect. Alright, I need to just leave them and not interrupt like I don't exist. I think he definitely has strength too. He's fighting too much now, though. Bro, what are you burn me for? You saw how much damage he did to you. Okay, whatever happens here, I'm actually happy with the result because I've non-stop fought when we could have just sat in a corner and been boring. So, yeah, I've had a good game. Nine kills, pretty insane, so... I'm happy with this. Alright, the border's closing in. We're in trouble. I need to just eat this because of the timer. Nice. Probably better to be out of the border. 